one heart, for one car, we're determined to rebuild and restore. We're
want to start the program now with prayer and to lead us on that we have the honor to call on the chief imam of Ereke Kenya Central Mosque to please give us uh, the opening prayer today being the 42nd edition of Ereke Day celebrations we thank you, Ayla, for the opportunity given us. We thank you, Ayla, for the life of the IDA president and his cabinet. We thank you, Ayla, for the life of our vice president. We thank you, Ayla, for the life of the wife of the vice president. We thank you, Ayla, for the life of all the royal fathers seated. We thank you, Ayla, for the life of all of us witnessing this occasion. We want to commit to this program into their hand. They want you to be with us, help us continue to be with us at the end of the program, which have have cause to glorify thy name. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Rabbana taqobali minna na tatasamila alim. Watibu alina ya ulana inna katatawa abu rahim. Rabbana afrika alina sabura. Wasep piti akida mana afansuna al-kawmi al-kafiri. Subhanaka Allahumma wa bihamdik. Nashiadu an la ilaha ila atatuli. سبحان ربك رب العزة عما يصفون والسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين. Representing her husband, Professor Yemi Oshiba, GCON, SDA. I welcome the chairman, 2018 Eric Day Grand Finale, Otoba Shekong Awolo. I welcome the chairman supporter, 2018 Eric Day Grand Finale, Otoba Shola Oulana. I welcome his Royal Majesty, the Akaribu and Paramount ruler of Remonan, ably represented by Onirunu of Irolu. Our Royal Father of the Day, Arakene of Ikene, Baba Ade Inka Onokade, our Royal Father of the Day, Oludotun of Idotun Remon, Baba Odunayo Sholani. I welcome all we are fathers, high chiefs, elders, members of board of trustees and all past president of ID, all ESCO members of ID, president and all member clubs of ID, president and members of the Kenan Youth Association, the area commander, the divisional police officer DPO, and other security personnel, the chairman and members of Ikenes Security Council, my dear wife, the Ekopala Odumosu, distinguished members of ITABU, members of the press, the distinguished ladies and gentlemen. Glory be to God Almighty for giving us the grace to witness the 42nd annual Ikenes Day celebration 2018. In my speech at the 40th Annual Eric's Day Celebration 2016, I promised to embark on projects that will impact positively and be of immediate benefit to the development of the entire Ukrainian community. In line with the above promise, the following projects were embarked upon and commissioned during the 42nd Eric's Day Celebration 2018. Operation Fifty Agent. The association IDA decided to dedicate this year's celebration to the agent members of the community, 80 years and above, by appreciating and recognizing their contributions to the development of the town. 
We distributed over 500 packs of 520 packs of rice with ingredients to all aged in Kenya indigenous, irrespective of their social and economic status. I want to appreciate by Sakule Shofala, who single-handedly fin financed this project on behalf of the Kenya Development Association, IDE. As his pledge project during the 40th annual Eric Day Celebration 2016, when he was the chairman supporter. God, in his infinite mercy, will continue to bless him and his family. May I use this opportunity to inform you that this gesture extended to the agent will henceforth be additional to the activities for the annual Eric Day celebrations. We seek your support individually and collectively. Solar street lights. 30 numbers of solar street lights were commissioned on Thursday, 1st November 2018, for the following streets Ademolu Odenaya Street, as the OAE Primary School Road, Ayebusi Road, Idotum, Itugodo, so Kajola Road, Ejino Junction, Itumolo, Ereke Center Road. The 30 solar street lights were donated by Otumba Shebun Awolo, being his project as the chairman of the 42nd annual Eric Day celebration grand finale. We pray for God's abundant blessing on him and his family as he promised to donate more. Roofing of the computer building debt at Ikene Community High School. In our response to the appeal by the principals of the Kenya Community High School, that's both junior and senior, on the above named project, donated by late Upper Lua Udukoya in the year 2000, the association embarked on the roofing of the building deck with aluminum roofing sheets. We pray the state government will come to the rescue of the school and further renovate at the building. Renovation of Magistrate Court building, Kenya Remo. The prominent member club of the association, the Dues Club, renovated the Magistrate Court building in NNMO by replacing all the windows with aluminum windows, piling of the court floors, and all the offices in the building, including that of the Chief Magistrate Office, and painting of the building along with other renovation works on behalf of the Kenya Development Association ID. And the entire Kenya community, I say big thank you to all members of this distinguished this club of Kenya Remo. Innovation and equipment of computer laboratory at United High School, Kenya. A newly registered club, Pinnacle International Club, Kenya, donated their board project to mark their entry into the Kenya Development Association ID. On behalf of the executive and all members club of the association, we appreciate this noble gesture and thank for God's blessing on the members of the club. The gate house at Obafe Marula Square. Another member club of ID, the Magnum Club, built and donated a gate house at Obafe Marula Square. Our sincere appreciation, prayer for God's blessing goes to all members of this club. Children's Place Center. Over state indigenous. In Dublin, Republic of Ireland, donated a well equipped children's play center to the association. The project was facilitated through an internet song in person of Mr. Jolu and Yoka. We say a big thank you and God bless you. Federal government projects. The Kenneth Development Association sincerely appreciates the Vice President, Federal Republic of Nigeria, Professor Iyemi Oshibayu for the developmental projects that were cited in the KNRM. Please permit me to mention a few. One, an ultra-modern market equipped with banking and other facilities. A water treatment plant at the present site of Ikene Town Hall. Channelization of Obafem Awolo Road to Obafem Awolo Primary School, KNRM. The dredging of Ikene Stream Dredging of Lake Road Stream into Nure Stream. Construction of Youth Empowerment Building at Olabisi Onobajo Road, Olabisi Onojoli Road, and the construction of the road and drainages of all other adjacent streets. I appreciate and thanking the Vice President, Federal Republic of Nigeria, 
Because they are not sugar cane. So they are both valuable projects in Kenya. We are pleading for an urgent work on the reconstruction and completion of the Kenya Shagam Road. Like the cheap butter company. We thank God Almighty for commencing for the commencement of production at the factory since the beginning of the year 2018. We use this opportunity to rejoice with the chairman of Black Group Limited, who is B. Onofokon, is the father of the day, for a dream fulfilled. We pray for long life and more blessing for Papa, in Jesus' name. In location of Abba Femi, I will have a college of basic medical science to Shagam and converted it to donated community buildings into hostels. As mentioned in my presidential address at the last Senegal Day Grand Finale, the Kenya Development Association ID instituted action against the state government, the Olabisi and Obanjo University, and the Board of Governors of the University over the said above matter, asking for an interim injunction restraining the authorities concerned from converting Kenya campus to hostels. Our request for interim injunction was granted and the university authority was restrained from converting the campus to hostel. I want to appreciate the IDA legal team led by the Chamber of Olunide Shofora SAM for holding brief for a Kenyan development association ID at the BRS minimum cost. God will continue to bless you, bless your work abundantly. Eric Civic Center. The little amount we were able to raise at the last Eric Day celebration to the chairman for the first Eric Day annual grand finale. And donation by, donations by member clubs was used to cast one quarter of the floor slab of the civic center. With the approval of the IDA general house, each member club of the association were to contribute a minimum of 100,000 for the construction of Eric civic center this year. We also plan to reach out for federal and state governments for financial assistance. We want to remind all the Kenyan indigenous that the Ereke City Center is our baby project. We are all must contribute to this early completion, both financially and materially. God bless us. Education and scholarship. Two, new, two newly registered IDA clubs, the Senate Club and the Joy Clubs, co-sponsor the education activities during this year Ereke Day celebration. The entire IDA body is to be grateful. We also want to appreciate the following people and others for granting scholarship to our children in various schools. Who is BA or not for Okon? Engineer Jeho Oshibamo, Otuba Adeleke Adeshino, Tikin Tunde Odumosu, Alagba Eso, Oyeni, Otuba Idowu Adeluga, Mr. Shola and Dr. Mrs. Yerisi Olabino, and Honorable Kule and Chief Mrs. Daniel Shonami. God bless you and your families. Security. We want to appreciate the effort of various security services, Nigerian Police, Civil Defense, SSS, and our own Ikene Security Council as the vigilante team for protecting lives and properties in Ikene. The Ikene Security Council as the vigilante is eight years old this year and must be given the credit for improving the security situation in Ikene. However, a lot needs to be done in respect of local crime, as is house and shop looting, youth clashes, etc. To Mr. Shedon Shofola Shomano, that is the head of the vigilante. Mr. Shola Shodino is the coordinator. Bere Masi Wodan, General Shoboiki, Power BA on Offer and others, that's for their financial support. And other members of the Kenneth Security Council, thanks for the job well done and God bless. Public Office Appointment. We recognize the appointment of the following Kenneth sons and daughter. Otoba Comrade Doin Adeshino as the chairman, Nigeria Union of Teachers, LUT, Lagos State. Mrs. Ibukun Odishote, Permanent Secretary, Federal Minister of Labor. Employment and Productivity. Mrs. Yetule Pinero, Judge, Lagos State High Court. On behalf of Kennedy Development Association, ID, 
and the Kenyan indigenous home and abroad. I say congratulations, wishing you more selfless service to your hometown, the Kenyan and Fatherland, Nigeria. Allah can help us. In the early 80s, when the activities of the day celebration was shifted to the present of Africa and the for Africa we are today, the Executive Committee of ID then agreed that the present town hall be converted to the Alakene of the Kenyan Palace in the future. With this in mind, the present Executive Committee and the General House of ID have agreed and approved that the Kenyan town hall should be renovated and refurbished to the Alak Nene Palace. The committee will be set up soon for this purpose. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, this is my appreciation to all distinguished ladies and gentlemen. My greatest appreciation is to God Almighty for a successful 42nd annual Day celebration 2018. All glory belongs to him. The chairman for the 2nd annual Day celebration grand finale. 2018, Otuba Sheikh Mawolo. We say thank you. Otuba Sheikh Mawolo donated 30 solar street lights as his first installment, being his project at the chairman for this year, the AKD annual celebration. Solar lights have been commissioned. We, also, we are also indeed grateful and we pray for God's abundant blessing on you and your family. My chairman supporter Otuba Shola Wulan, we thank you for honoring us and Kenya, your hometown. God will continue to honor me and your family. To all distinguished guests, thanks for coming. But sincere thanks go to all members of the ID. You be blessed and all loving Kenyan indigenous women and people for your moral and financial support. Sincere thanks go to inner working organs of ID. The Executive Committee, Action Committee, and all subcommittees for a successful 42nd annual Election celebration. The blessing of the Lord be upon you and your family. The thanks given to Randolph, to Randolph, the first second annual Election Day celebration hosts tomorrow, Sunday, 4th November 2018, at Christ Apostolic Church, CAC, Dakota, Okay, Ghana. By 9 a.m., please join us and we as we appreciate God's blessing. Wishing all God's mercies and blessing as we return to the various institutions. Happy celebration. Thank you very much. Uh, I would like to invite the chairman of our second annual Day celebration, October. Shego Awolo to present this speech. While that one is going on, I want to recognize the arrival of the Alaye of Odoguru, His Royal Highness of our Ayyid Odoguru and the Ololi. You are welcome, sir. Otumba Awolo, sir. The Vice President of Nigeria, Professor Yemi Oshiba. The wife of the Vice President of Nigeria, Mrs. Jolako Oshibari, representatives of state government, representatives of local government, our royal fathers, the President and Executives of the Internet Development Association, honorable members of various clubs and associations. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you all to the fourth second Eureka Day celebration organized and led by the Internet Development Association (IDA), a body that consistently seems to the success of this wonderful initiative of our founding fathers, who selflessly in the interest of the unity of the Kenyan, laid the foundation 42 years ago. I also welcome our friends that travel from far and wide to be part of this great occasion. May the Lord bless your works. The fact that we pride ourselves at the first and the 
based in community development. It's not an overstatement. It is in fact a model copied by all the sundry. That is why we should give kudos to the initiators. Just breaking away from the bitterness, the CDC and political privatization created by the politics of the old Western region, we decided to close the gap by encouraging the sons and daughters of the Kenyan to come home to integrate and engage in the development of our town. This no doubt was addressed to the structural deficit in the town over the years. This has also attracted us back to our lands. When we come together during the reading, it is pertinent for us to take a stock of the outgoing year, to thank God Almighty for the year in the and to pray for the incoming year to be a success in our efforts to deliver our developmental strategies in order to take the town to an enviable heights. So that was done. Therefore, I want to make this passionate plea to all the Indians who continue in the spirit of oneness to disregard any apathy that can be brought about as a result of differences in either political or religious affiliation to break the current call of the IDA. To invest in the development of the tenant and also a call to the government not to forget the abandoned projects within the local government so that our communities will be more attractive to indigenous and consequently encourage urban rural trade. The timing of this year's team, which is towards a better living for the age, is not by coincidence, but rather by the reality of the situation within and around our community. This we focus our minds towards acknowledging the increasing challenges facing the most vulnerable in our community, out of which the eight are the most prominent. Going further from here, it is my wish that the IDA direct their energy and resources towards this group of people and also be a voice to this voiceless set of people so that government the art to extend a social program in all forms to this age group in our community in a bid to improving or rather to better their living. I want to appreciate our diaspora sons and daughters who in their various countries of sojourn still congregate to associate themselves under IDA. There is no better time than now for IDA to have a certainty to coordinate and land with as many IDA associations outside the country and facilitate direct foreign investment into the town. If the presidency can have SA on diaspora, IDA can equally do with the secretary on diaspora. Technically, we should ask the people to support and encourage any bona fide son and daughter of the Kenyan who aspire for any higher position in the public space. I want us to, as we always do, put aside our personal differences to support such aspiring candidates. By so doing, we are putting the Kenyan on the sound of greatness. Let us adopt and adapt the digitalization policy to the Kenyan. Let our children be the Kenyan first. Finally, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, let us build upon the efforts and achievements of our founding fathers. Let us also remember the common heritage that unites us as a people. Permit me to commend and congratulate the IDA executives who, with the organizing committee, have worked tirelessly to make the subjects of this year's celebration. May the Lord bless your homes and family. For those friends and well-wishers who travel to celebrate with us, 
the joy of celebration cannot cease from your homes. Long live Nigeria, long live Ogun State, and long live Ikenen. Thank you very much. I would like to invite our own the wife of His Excellency, Professor Yemi Oshibanyo.
today i'm very very happy thank you very very much i would just like to thank the ikene association the ida the chairman the president for this beautiful gift they've given to me today thank you so much and i would like to advise youth like me they should keep doing it they should keep chasing it they can do it you stop saying i can't do it one day they'll surely get there thank you thank you so much
My name is Otumba Shegun Awolowo, and I am the chairman of the 42nd Erike Day Celebration. Uh, why we're having Erike Day is, um, is twofold. Firstly, it's for the, uh, to facilitate the socio-economic development of Ikene Town, and also to encourage Ikene indigenous to both uh, in diaspora and home, you know, to integrate or come back home. Yeah, the theme of this year, Erike Day, is uh, caring for the elderly. And why they did that is like, because um, a lot of our elderly have been forgotten and they have not been taken care of. And um, that is part of those uh, messages I'm preaching this year that uh, we should try to help um, our senior citizens because uh, my personal belief is that if we help them, God will help us as well. Well, by the past achievements, there have been a lot recorded. We have had a lot of uh, people, a lot of uh, Ikena indigenous from abroad, from here, integrating some have got in to get married you know with each other and they come in here they get to know their family backgrounds and get to know the history and their heritage so we have succeeded in in achieving that and uh, many other developments that a lot of well-being uh, ikena indigenous have contributed immensely to the development of uh, ikena town Yeah, we have, uh, well, firstly, uh, human resources. We have a lot of smart, intelligent, business entrepreneurial. You have heard about this, uh, 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 some of these, uh, uh, in agriculture, we have developed greatly. Uh, so those are, those are the two major areas that I think, you know, investors could come in and, and assist us. I greet all my fellow uh, Ikene indigents and all both, both in diaspora and at home, and I welcome them. I hope they come on a consistent basis for this celebration, and we hope to bring it to the next level, you know, by the grace of God. Next year, we hope to do better, and we hope more people will come, just like we had this time. We have friends from every part. We have a lot of Ikena indigenous that came from abroad, from the States, from London, from everywhere, and they came just to celebrate with us. And this is such a beautiful celebration we, we are having today. Ah, eh, 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 e
lopo lopo eh fun anfani ti e fun mi lati je chairman occasion in this 42nd uh, uh, celebration and lagbara olohun gbogbo wa na gbogbo ata wa si bala ma dile layo atalafia and uh, ali ma se bayi lodo dun atelu ma se better and better ese my name is Otumba Shegun Awolowo. Keep on watching Coded TV. Thank you, sir. I'm not going to be able to do it.